um, hemispheric differences are very striking, not only in human beings, but in many primates and sort of other, other animals. And uh, uh, its um, um, doubleness is partly built into, you know, uh, into the vertebrate frame, so that we have two kidneys and sort of limbs on each side. We're, we're symmetrical in most ways, but the the two halves of the brain do seem, although obviously they normally they always work together, they do seem rather different in character and function. And it's very much as if the dominant hemisphere, which is usually the left hemisphere of the brain, is concerned especially with um, uh, logical thought and analysis, um, and uh, sometimes relatively routine, intellectual routines of one sort and another, and the right half of the brain much more to do with emotion, with novelty, with intuition, and to some extent with, with identity. And one can't really say that one half is more important than the other because they, uh, they have to come together completely. Mm -hmm.